trying to tell them that we only gave you this right here. Little place to stand around at East Jerusalem Baptist Church in Hannesburg. A few days removed from a deadly tornado. This is a volunteer response center, which is, that's what it's for, to coordinate the volunteer response. The church is one of two locations set up to marshal volunteers who really want to help storm victims. People like Malcolm Diaz. I was here to help some families out, buy some meals. They are also trying to weed out others who may not have the truest intentions, but are showing up at distribution sites like this. Sarah Allen says it is upsetting. What do you see that makes you angry? Knowing that you one hit, knowing that you not in the disaster, and you coming up here and you taking from the people that really need it. One of the lessons they learned here, not only from Hurricane Katrina, but the tornado that rolled through three years ago, a number of scam artists and people looking to hustle moving in in the wake of a big storm. So at work sites like this one off of Gulfport Street in Hattiesburg, students from William Carey are hard at work right next to off-duty policemen and plumber Joseph Virgil, who is helping and warning storm victims what to look out for before hiring a contractor. I don't want people to take the first contractor that come in, uh, get with some of your locals, trying to find your, your licensed contractor. Words of warning at a time when storm victims are grateful for the volunteer help and being warned to be on guard for those who are looking to take their money. In Hattiesburg, Scott Simmons, 16 WAPT News.